If you are in torque mode, this screen cannot be changed. However, in any of the other modes, this screen could be helpful. It relates to how the drive syncs in and out of motion with an existing input signal. There is a good explanation of this in the help file under set point control. I will look under that set point control right now. Go to index, type set point control, and there it comes up. If I double click on set point control, I will see the explanation of exactly how this operation and this screen functions. I will give a brief explanation of it right now, however. Say, for example, there is a 5 volt signal from an external source being input to the Compax 3. This voltage might relate to 1000 RPM, but no motion would happen until the drive is enabled and the set point input is activated. Once these two inputs are active, the drive ramps up to match that command signal at the ramp rate 1. The Compax 3 will follow that command signal exactly until set point input is deactivated. The drive will then ramp down to zero speed at ramp rate number two, even though the voltage still may be present. You can see the state of X12-6 and X12-7 on the picture here. This is the energized motor input and the enable set point value input, respectively. A detail of this connector's pinout can be found in the help under X12. Click Next when complete.